Oh my god, guys! Happy transgender and gay and lesbian and queer... Lesbian... LG, lesbian, gay, trans... LG, B, bi, T, trans... Queer... Plus, whatever else is in the plus, guys. Wow, that was a lot of things I had to remember, but I've got everyone included there. I've not missed a single soul except straight, but they're fucking weirdos, you know. <laughs> the scum. So I thought, let's celebrate Transgender Day by looking at some fantastic clips. Now, just before we get started, there's no hate here. It's only it's only hatred for myself and my life. <laughs> get yourself fucking together. I'm just here to have a little bit of a good time and look at these men who have inverted their peepees. And uh, it's just brilliant. Look, uh, gather round. This, this might be a slightly longer video because I want to show my support. You know, I don't think I made a video truly on the LGBT clue plus minus divide times and divided and multiply by 10. So let's get balls deep into this bitch and see what these ladies and men have to say or they's. I don't forget anyone. She, 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 her. Okay. Yeah, it's okay. It's all it looks like uh, he's having a uh, nice piece. She, 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 her. Okay. Yeah, it's okay. It's all good. But it was not all good. But it was not all good. You got Ryan Reynolds commentating in the back for dramatic effect. In a, <coughs> in a world divided by gender, I got called a he. I use she, her pronouns. I'm not sir. Oh, okay. Yeah, like it, it. It's like a knife in the heart. I also, I did specifically ask ahead of time not to be called sir. Yeah, I'm just gonna go. <laughs> Well, I hope you paid for your fucking water, you thieving fucker. Have you ever accidentally called someone John when their name's Michael? Have you accidentally called someone Louisa when their name was, in fact, Lewis? I have done all of the above multiple times a day, and guess what? You just go, oh, sorry, John. Oh, sorry, Lewis. You know, you don't really make a big song and dance, stand up, film it, and then, you know, move your table as your fucking penis slaps it. I mean, you don't have a pin. You don't move the table when you you know, your big, your big muscles and your legs, you know, knock the table back, because guess what? People make mistakes. It's not, it's called you sir. Sir is like a polite thing. It's said, oh, you can't. Would you like to hurry up and pay your bill? You know what I mean? That would have been a bit... Would you have preferred that? Probably, to be fair. Okay. The sweet water starts at... Okay. Not... I mean, I'm so sorry. I apologize. It's just always, like, a knife. It always hurts. Every single time. I was wondering if there's a manager I could talk to about something that happened. Yeah, I, I was called sir. Okay. It just really sucks every time it happens. What an absolute... I have, you know, sympathy for transgenders and whatever, what have you, getting your wrong name. I mean, look, respectfully, you might dress like a girl, but you don't really look nor sound like one, and you probably don't smell like one, unless you've got that Ariana Grande shit under your armpits. To go to a manager and get a person in potential trouble because they have said sir in a way of respectfully trying to communicate with you. You know, I call people sir and madam when you don't know. You know, you can't remember the name. Thank you, sir. Don't worry, sir. Yes, madam. Just because someone calls you sir does not mean you have to throw a tantrum and throw your fucking oil off your plate and get a manager involved, you absolute dumb dumb wom wom. I don't need to be called ma'am. I just need to not be called sir, you know? Thank you. Did you call me sir? I, I just want to tell you that the person who gave me this called me sir. What? Called me sir. It's just like, it kind of just hurts. It's a knife in the heart. It's a lot to get called sir. Get over yourself, dude. You are... Oh, sorry. Get over yourself, madam. <laughs> that was a genuine mistake. Get over yourself, lady... Lady. Ma'am. The world does not revolve around you. People do not need to change their language. If someone calls you sir, just say, just move on. You know, I don't understand these people. They're doing it for attention. You can see the mic, and that's the only reason people are apologising. If you, if you said, oh, I'm not sir, I'd be like, okay. You know, I won't say sorry, because I'm not sorry. I admit, you know, you want to be called a certain thing, and I'm happy to abide by your rules some of the time. But I'm not... I'm not. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I called you a sir trying to be polite when really you were a sir for 40 years and then you snip, 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 snipped. Now you want to change your fucking language. Are you mad? I have a theory though. What if we just call them it? You know, I don't want to be called it. Don't get me wrong. No one does. But at the end of the day, if you're going to complain about sir, which is polite, maybe we can go down a different route. Very good. Thank you so much. No. Oh, I'm. Yeah. Thank you. I'm not a sir. <sighs> Uh, yeah, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, sir. What are you talking about? Honestly, I'm not. I'm really not. I'm a fucking woman. Don't you see me fucking boobs? I'm wearing a fucking denim jacket. Ever seen a man wear a denim jacket like this? Obviously, these are all jokes, by the way. I'm just having a bit of fun. Like, I'm happy to call you whatever you want, but stop getting so peevy. The world doesn't revolve around you. That's a sh that pissed me off. Misgendering. It does, it is a knife in the gut. It's a knife in the gut. Oh, yeah. When I get called sir, I, f I feel like I need to tell him. <laughs> 
<laughs> I just feel like I need to tell him. You called me sir. Um, and? Oh, look at me. I'm clearly a woman. Oh, right. You're a woman. Thank you, my lady. Quick curtsy. I need to tell him that that hurt. It hurts more, though, and it's not intentional because it means, like, this, the, this is sir to him. I know you didn't mean it, but I'm not a sir. I'm so sorry. It's okay. I know you didn't mean it. It's just, you know, it hurts. I know when people clock me, it's, it's fine, but, like, it does kind of hurt. Thank you. The real crime here is that fucking dog. I mean, that is animal abuse right there. That that poor thing does not want to be put through. And look, I, I get you You want to dress as a woman, and that's cool. And, you know, you are a woman, apparently. Which I'm fine with, by the way, apparently. But I just don't like this whole... I. It's like, it's, how many times have, have they... I'm going to call them they. She. She or they. Whatever she preferred. I can't remember. Um, shows how much attention I'm paying to her. Bang! Ten points to Gryffindor. I got it right. How many times is she going to say, oh, yeah, it's like a knife in the heart. And the stab a fucking gut. Like, well, your heart's not there, sweetheart. I know you've, you know, chopped off your wiener, but it's not changed, the, you know, the rest of your anatomy. Look, I've probably called someone a sir when sees a seat, and it, it, um, you know, it's not as in, like, a transgender either. You know, and guess what they do? They just sort of look at you a bit funny and go, here you go, I meant her, I meant she, I meant it, I meant you, I meant thank you. I'm not, sir. Oh, not, sir. Not, sir. But the guy who dropped... The, the food off. He called me sir twice in a row. Thank you, I appreciate that. I'll let our general manager know just so you can feel better about yourself. How about that? I mean, no disrespect to this person here, but she's clearly doing it for attention. She films herself every time, Lily Tino, because she wants these views and she wants people like me to make horrible videos on it. Now, let's get something straight. I'm not being horrible. I'm just being truthful. It's not a big deal being called the wrong thing. If someone called me a girl, I'd probably have a bit of a giggle to myself. And I know it's a stab in the heart. Oh, God. It's like, my name's Harrison. If someone called me fucking Harry, no, that's not relevant at all. But I just don't think you should... <laughs> I'm, I've lost my train of thought, but, you know, just because you dress, you know, you shouldn't expect people to know, you know, you should wear, like, a, I don't know, but, you know, them stickers that people wear on, like, the first day, you know, like, hi, I'm Jerry, hi, I'm a girl, <laughs> stick that on your forehead, and if someone makes a mistake then, then, yeah, I'll give you it, they're clearly a bit in a pissy mood, and don't really like you. Now, just to end on this, now, this is just a beautiful video I found online that I think is just really important to share, and just to demonstrate and love and care for all the transgenders and LGBTQ plus homies, um, so so yeah, here's another one. As you can see, we've got a fine specimen on the plate here. Obviously, there'd be enough to go around all year, but oh God, that was, that was, that was, that, you know, talk about knives in the heart. I feel bad just saying that. We had a happy first pride, didn't we, boys? Not first pride. First pride is me as trans. Whoa. Just called them guys boys, by the way. You know what I mean? Do you, do you know? Oh, Get your fucking act together. You, I was about to call her a whale, but I'm not sure I can do that. They had a happy pride, right? Yeah. Yeah? They're tired. <laughs> Yes, I am so glad you dragged me here to put me through so much pain and misery and hold this fucking rainbow. It's amazing. Let me get something straight. I'm all for gay pride. I think it's important that we uh, appreciate them. I don't think they need a whole month. You know what I mean? I think a, a day, maybe a long weekend is probably enough. You know, what are you going to do for 30 days, homies? Like, how many flags have you got in fucking storage? I mean, we get it. You know, it's important to include these people. I get that. And now I'm really feeling uncomfortable with this lady or this person, this they staring at me. I mean, her. Her, her bicep is bigger than my head. I, 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 I'm just pointing out a fact, you know, do with that how you please. Happy Pride. Uh, yes, happy Pride. I'm going to let you all know, because there some, seem to be some people that don't like us celebrating Pride. Honey, I'm a proud of trans women. I don't have to be proud, because often, more times than not, I get ridiculed for being who I am. And see, that is a problem. Uh, you know, I'm not ridiculing anyone. I'm just, um, I'm kind of a Cool. But, you know, it is kind of a, an amusing time to be alive, isn't it? You know, and I think the important thing is that we, we, you know, I don't hate anyone. I don't particularly love anyone either. But it's just important to know that, you know, you shouldn't really be pushing this onto your little kid, should you? Don't you think? Yes. Good Lord. And I'm going to be proud. It, today is our Pride Festival. And yes, our content centered around that. You don't have to announce you're leaving either. Pete. Off his, uh... Hi, Pete. Look, none of them want to be there. No one of them want to be filmed by this transgender parent or whatever it is, friend, colleague, fucking long-lost cousin, whoever it might be. My God, leave them alone. Yeah, like... You like that fan? He loves it. So yeah, we're going to be proud and loud. We're going to take up space. Yes, that makes... <laughs> Very poor choice of words. Literally, Heath Ledger Joker. Very poor choice of words, Batman. <laughs>
<laughs> you're gonna take up space whether you pride it or not, baby. God damn, Harrison, you evil. You evil. You evil can evil. But look, when you search pride, it just comes up with gay pride. So, you know, clearly um, no one gives a fuck about any other type of pride. But, you know, let, let, let's be serious for a moment. Happy gay month. I'm glad you all get it. I look forward to my month of celebration just for being pretty cool. Like I said, I don't give a shit whether you're gay or not, bro. But stop looking for attention, turning it into something. <laughs> he misgendered me. Called me sir in a polite fashion when I am in fact not a sir. Oh my god, what's he gonna do? Shut up, dude. Shut up. He literally doesn't care. Happy Pride Month, my, my gay homies. I'm glad we're here together. We can enjoy this exciting time. Look at this dude here. He's about to fucking fly. Anyway, that's enough gayness for a day. Let me know if you like um, penis and you have a penis. I'm just gonna stop.